Hi everybody, it's Kathy from Huckleberry Herbs and Art and I'm here to show you today the Heartfelt Creations Pampered Pooch Collection. And that's my Pampered Pooch getting a drink right now, Huckleberry. <laughs> if you want any of these things, you can get them at huckleberryherbs.com. I'll leave the link down below. And um, you can find lots of Heartfelt Creations, Graphic 45, uh, Tim Holtz, inks and delusions and journals and paint and all kinds of laces and doodads for your crafting. So come on over and visit my store and uh, sign up on the contact page for news. All right, so um, first of all, before I get started, if anybody's uh, looking for a good snowman set of stamps, the Frolicking Frosty, I have a couple of those that I'm replacing the ones that sold out. These are really well done snowmen. I love their smiles and their shape and their backgrounds, which if you don't want the background, you can um, cut that out. Okay, so look at this. They sent me some sample cards of what we're about to look at, the Pampered Pooch Collection. So Heartfelt had their papers for Christmas and the holidays and winter out in August, and they have moved on to these adorable images. I was so hoping that Heartfelt would do something like this because people are making cards with so many um, cute little creatures and stuff and I love the flowers and all of the lacy looks and beautiful dyes but I love my doggies too so this is so sweet um, and uh, this is just adorable the way they did this with Dimension and these images are in the stamps, the dyes and the papers. So let's get to the papers which have such cute images and if you're not familiar with Heartfelt Creations this is what they do. They give you so that you can just cut out lots of different paper card shapes and you can embellish them from there or just call it a day and have a card that you put together that looks exactly the way that you would like it to. Look at these lovely borders with the paws and the bones and these cute little dogs all lined up and this is a great um, pack for layouts too if you have a uh, scrapbooking that you do there's a lot of good layout pages in here and look at these guys all lined up in front of that fence which some of us have the celebrate the seasons fence and so as usual with heartfelt we can find a repeat of the images that we've purchased before to blend so well. Look at that guy taking his bath. He reminds me very much of my dog Brandy from years ago. And so, for example, there's the butterflies from the butterfly collection. And then look at this handsome fellow up in the corner here. Just perfect for a layout that maybe uh, would include some pictures of your family playing with the family dog. And I don't know, did I? Oh, yeah. So you also get the sentiments. So you get everything you need. All different card shapes, full-size pages, sentiments, tags, tickets, stamps in beautiful colors. I love the dark colors if you're getting tired of working with your Christmas and holiday things right now. Maybe you would want to take a break. And um, this die and stamp set that they have there's so many things you can do with that. It's meant to be a collar, of course, but you can make it into bracelets and other things. So here's some more of the smaller cards with the beautiful lace. Some of us have the corner die that goes with that. Nice little rustic image here. And there's that guy in his bathtub. Now these are the new pages Heartfelt has come out with that actually fit the dies so if you're on the run have to put a card together and you don't have time to sit there and color all the images in then you can just die cut really quickly and create a nice three-dimensional card or something else maybe a, a box or a treat box or something that you're going to bring to somebody's house who just got a new pet and you're going to go visit the new puppy the new member of the family can make really cute little treat bags for your friends who have pooches. This guy's going on a trip here and he's into mischief. Lots of different dogs here so it's appealing to lots of uh, people who have different types of dogs, different species. Look at this one. This is perfect with the paw 
pads running through it. And another example of one of those full spreads that you could maybe make a treat box for your kitchen with or something. And what else would you use things like dogs for? Well, how about boy cards? Okay, for sure. How about tweens when you're not sure what they're into but you know they love their dog or they love animals? You could make a birthday card with these. What if somebody is getting a puppy for Christmas and maybe he's announced by some sort of a card or something left by the the famous guy <laughs> and these lovely daisies with layers again including script running throughout and ghost images as always with heartfelt creations they make sure that there's a lot of interesting layers with their papers some nice stripes in some masculine colors and a lovely layout page here and of course you can cut, fussy cut these out or make them into the size card that you want so many things that you can do with these, these gorgeous american made papers lovely made in america paper made in america just heard about another couple of mills closing so i'm so glad that heartfelt's able to get the papers made here so very sweet nice peachy tan tones uh, perfect for shabby chic. Okay, so if you don't want the image on the other side, use the second side. And very versatile. Covers many bases, as they say. Here's some more larger tags, and we're coming into some of the 6 by 6s One's getting away from me. Again, some good masculine colors on that one. So here are the 6x6s. Six if you'd like to make 6x6 six six cards or you're making 6x6 six six albums, maybe you want to make a um, make an album for your pet to put all the puppy pictures in and keep track of his years. Or you are um, gathering up the photos of past pets. I know I took a frame at one point and all the photos that my husband and I had of all the pets that we had had since childhood, anything I could get my hands on, and uh, I have that hanging in my craft room actually with all my past little friends and his too, so when he visits my craft room, his buddies are up there as well. Some more tags in the actual traditional shape of the tags. There's the tickets up here, the stamp shapes, and another lovely peachy tone with Lots of texture in the layers and depth to the colors. So there are the papers, and I'll show you the sets that come with this. Well, sold separately, but match it. Let's put it that way from the Pampered Pooch collection. This stamp stamps out this collar, or you can turn it in. I've seen some people doing some wonderful uh, faux leather with paper that this would look great. You could make some very interesting things with that. And then the stamp that stamps out the, the little guys all in a row. And these images of the, that we saw in the papers of the dogs giving a hug. And this guy with his sort of, did I get caught look going on. And this would be a part of this as far as I know. Quite a few stamps. I know they're not the most inexpensive stamp sets, but they are very quality um, made, well made, and beautiful clear images when you stamp them out. And here's the die that goes with that, and that even stamps out, or sorry, cuts some of the paws. So you get the row, you get the guy covering his eye and the hug, you get a set of the paws which is on a different stamp, and you get the be uh, belt or the uh, collar from the Pampered Pooch Pals die. And then we have paw effect pooches with different size bones. So you could actually probably make some tags out of the bone um, that comes the largest. And then these nice guys here row in a row with, so you have two different rows, just so you see that. So you can actually make quite a long with lots of different dogs. Uh, life is better with you in it. Happy birthday. Wolf thinking of you. So not only the beautiful images, but quite a few cute little sentiments come with this set. And then pampered fruit pooch with my best friend. 
life is good, the cute little guy getting his bath, and the little mischievous fellow in the suitcase, and best wishes. So all those stamps in that set, and I think, yep, you're perfect, perfect. <laughs> so this is the one that comes with the paws, the paw pads, and a single paw. Doggone, I missed your birthday. That's cute. I really miss, I really missing you. I'm really missing you. You're, you're perfect. And there's the one coming out of the jeans. Okay, the jeans and the one in the little rustic crate with the little bottles with the flower. So all those stamps in that. And perfect pooches die, which has the other row of the doggies. And this happy smiling guy cuts him out, cuts out all three sides of the bones, cuts out the small and larger paw pads. Perfect. Veterinary school, graduation, becoming a vet, opening a vet um, facility or a store, new pets, young people's birthdays, and just lovers of animals like myself. Okay, so um, I did not get the Italiana Riviera as I had hoped last week. Uh, next page is in the mini album. Not only is this choir director and music teacher extremely busy, but the electricity went out so I could not craft and film. And yeah, that was not a great weekend. And uh, this weekend I am packed. So I'm trying, guys, to get the next one out. And uh, along with a couple other things, I've actually had to scrub the ink off my hands because I've been playing with my... Uh, paints from um, Ranger and uh, Diane Reevely and my journals and I'll try to come back and show you some of the things I've been doing with that. I've also been working a little bit with calligraphy. So yeah, when I have time I sit down try to squeeze in a few minutes and uh, huh, I hope you have more time to craft than I. Anyway, it was great seeing you. Don't forget to subscribe if you like to see these close-ups as well as see some other things that come in from the store and some of my projects. Thank you so much. I hope everybody's doing well. So sorry I'm not able to leave tons of comments right now, but I will as soon as I get a break from school. Till next time, everybody, this is Kathy from Huckleberry Herbs and Art. God bless.